Hey guys, how's it going? I wanted to take a moment to talk to you about Waterwolf, what we are, what we're doing, and why we're doing it. On VR Chat, we are finding that most of YouTube content, which is primarily where the community finds and makes a judgment about VR and VRC in general, is they get kind of a, this is a sketchy place. You don't want to be here. You don't want to put your kids in here. And we want to see it at the nine o'clock news on how it's destroying society. I don't believe that. I don't think that's the case. I think it's a really unique experience and you kind of have to see the right side of it to understand it. VR chat's a beautiful place. It's a wonderful place filled with fun people, fun times, and there's unlimited amounts of things to do. At the core of VR chat, everything in this world is user created. The world is, the avatars are. The crew does a really good job making this world feel real or video game real. And I fully believe that video games are a great way to unlock someone's potential to learn and be better. So VR chat utilizes the Unity engine and it spares no expense putting you right in front of Unity and teaching you how to use it and getting your programming legs running fast. They created an entire programming framework called Udon that lets you create drag and drop programming logics inside the editor. They do a really good job getting people to be smart about this. And so with that being said, VR chat is amazing for getting people talented. The quest you see, that's like an entryway. That's like the starting point. It's very limited. And so we're creating worlds that are VR compatible with the quest. And it's also beautiful enough to be enjoyable and efficient and programming and learning how to do that. So at the core of our community is being a good person, doing the right thing and trying to help out as much as we can. None of this is obligatory. It's all volunteer based, good people hanging out and following a principle of doing the right thing, acting right and being nice to your friends. Because it's so easy in the land of the internet to hide behind the anonymous mask and be a mean person. And I hope to change that with Waterwolf. All the people that you see that associate with Waterwolf are good people. They act good people. They are good people. And they help good people just like you. And that's the reason why we created Waterwolf. At its core, it's a community filled with good people to do good things. We're building worlds, making avatars, having good times together, finding more friends and growing our reach. I want to change the view of VR chat. I want to change it to where people enjoy it and go, wow, that's really cool. I would like to join that. That seems like a fun time. So I'm going to start flooding the YouTube with fun experiences, good worlds, fun things to do happy people, and hopefully we can one by one change the perception of it being a terrible place to an enjoyable place, because it really is. It's all about how you choose. It's all about how you interact with VR chat. If you choose to go to places that are just not exactly good, then yeah, you're going to have a bad time. But if you choose to go hang out with your friends in private instancing, or you set your shields right, you actually can have a really good time and meet a lot. I mean, a lot of good people. So that's the premise of why we're doing what we're doing. And I am feeling like it's important to make this video and explain that. And I figured I needed to do it in more of a, a direct setting to kind of explain and talk to you on a more personal level. You guys have a great night and I hope to see you on VR chat soon.